Hello everyone, Honda recently introduced their newest motorbike, the Honda 500 FTAR Heritage Edition, which appears with a scrambler style and cool graphics that are similar to the results of the modification. And what the motorbike looks like, let's discuss it. Uh, the graphics on the Honda uh, 500 FTAR Heritage Edition are inspired by the legendary FTAT 250 model which won the MA flat track race in 1984 and 1985. Honda combines a blue and white tank design with red striping, as well as a gold Honda wing logo, giving the impression of an attractive modification. As the, the modified design can also be seen on the red leather seats following the style of the first generation FTR. The front fender is dominated by white, well, the frame remains black, adding a unique impression to this motorbike. The front fender, which was originally white, was also changed to white so that the appearance is more in sync with the body. Um, even though it looks sportier, the Honda 500 FTAR Heritage Edition has not undergone any mechanical upgrades. As for specifications, the Rebel 500 sibling is equipped with a liquid-cooled 471 CICC 8-valve inline 2-cylinder engine. Um, the engine is claimed to have a power of 46 HP at 8500 RPM and a torque of 43.4 Newton meters at 6250 RPM, which is channeled to a 6-speed transmission with assist and slipper clutch technology. The features it carries are also similar to the Rebel 500, such as a fully digital circular instrument panel, full LED lights, security system, his emergency stop signal S. Unfortunately, there is no information about the price of the Honda Cult 500 after Heritage Edition, but the standard version is priced from 26,800 by. So that's our review for today, and see you in the next video.